They want to give children the jab to make vaccine passports viable. So that's why they want the entire population to be vaccinated and not just the most vulnerable, quote unquote. Uh, if this really was about a virus, then restrictions would be lifted after the most vulnerable were vaccinated. Children may be given vaccine by the end of year. Anyone dumb enough to give a child this vaccine should not have children. Uh, they are not at risk and it is sinister. The desperation to give children this mRNA vaccine. Please wake up. This is sick. They are not at risk. Children are not at risk. And it is sinister. The desperation to give children this mRNA vaccine. Okay. Let's, let's consider the long, potential long-term effects of this if it's rolled out to children. Uh, now, this is an article from Environment from uh, Michigan State University, Environment, Environmental Health and Safety. Uh, it's called Handling Prions, Re Recommended Biosafety Practices for Handling Prions. Now, what are prions? Well, they, they cause disease. Now, what are prions? Well, they, they cause disease, uh, neurological diseases and so on. You can end up with Alzheimer's disease, for example. Okay, so I want to highlight this uh, scientific paper, uh, which I don't know whether it's been peer reviewed at this point. I don't believe peer review is a good thing at all. But the fact that this guy brings it up in passing is a tell. I'm calling bullshit. UK column news is controlled opposition fear poetry. I enjoy Mayor Twilliger and I encourage folks to follow his channel. He's one of the best out there. If you're not from Australia, that's fine. He shows us all how to read our own propaganda and we would be wise to learn from their example. His exposés are courageous. Mayor Twilliger posted this clip without any of his usual commentary. And I hope he wants us all to recognize extravagant fear poetry on our own when it stares us in the face. Apart from feeding the belief in the invisible, the UK column news guys are keeping people afraid of stuff nobody can detect in preparation for worse. We are being pre-programmed. Now let's look at this study. A wealth of knowledge has been published on a class of RNA binding proteins shown to participating in what's going on here. They can't complete a sentence. Causing a number of neurological diseases, including Alzheimer's disease and Lou Gehrig's disease, as dramatized by the poor old late Stephen Hawking. We are being pre-programmed, folks, to accept vaccinoculation as the salvation for everything. Get ready for pharmaceutical slavery, all for our own good. The richest of the richest people in the world love us. Let us hear some more gobbledygook so that we can all feel like we are smart little scientists now. Let's get our lab coats out and clipboards, rattle on with some technical mumbo jumbo that none of us understands until we get to the scary, scary parts. Long live the science fiction of biological cartoons. You don't need any pictures now to be afraid, do you?